Tegnuse chapter of the African Democratic Congress, ADC, on Friday accused the ruling Hall Progressive Congress, APC, the Highlight People's Movement, APM, of the facing billboards and cutting away a board adverts of his governorship candidate, Prince Gwe Ghana Suru Isiaka. ADC also accused the parties of allegedly unleashing mayhem on its members during campaigns in parts of the state. Briefing journalists at the campaign headquarters of the party in Abeokuta, the Director General of Boyega National Research Campaign Organization, Engineer Tony Ojeshino, said the political intolerance of APC and APM may pose a threat to the peaceful conduct of the 2019 general elections in the state. Moving away from core security concerns, we are again shocked at the display of intolerance impunity and breach of peace by our opposition. Since two weeks ago, we installed in some parts of the state, capital and other towns, our advert materials called A-boards, usually put on road mediums. This similar initiative is also implemented by the ruling APC and its splinter party APM where they also placed their airboards on the road medians and all coexisted. We notice, however, that since the 20th of December, our reflective airboards began to disappear one after the other from the roads. Our in initial inquest showed that it was not carried out by the state select agency. And after deploying our people for late night monitoring, we discovered to our charging that it was some hoodlums that were defacing the boards and cutting them away with impunity. On two occasions last week, our surveillance group met the hoodlums in action. And upon seeing some faces they didn't know, they jumped into their car and ran away. Some of them adorned apparel, t-shirts, and casticles that gave them away as agents of the ruling APC and APM. Just four days ago, the police patrol van from the Ibarra division accosted these Ulums while throwing our balls into the gutter and defacing them. On sighting the police van parking by them, they again bolted away. Indeed, we got hints from the police to the effect. Recovering the airports from the canals where the opposition went to dump them. And you can see here how some of those airports have been destroyed. These are the destroyed boards dumped at several canals around the state capital by agents of the APC and the APM. We condemn these incidents in their entirety. Our party, ADC, is peaceful, and our governorship candidate, Prince Buegan Nazi Isiaka, GNI, is peace loving and has a history of violent free issues-based campaign since 2011. We do not know why the opposition is fighting of competitive campaigns and hell-bent on bringing down the House. We urge that they halt this negative trend because we shall henceforth resist these shameful acts with all that is lawfully feasible. We hereby call on the Commander-in-Chief of Nigeria's armed forces, President Muhammad Buhari, the Inspector General of Police, the Director General of the Department of State Security, the State Commissioner of Police, civil society organization, the media, and generality of Nigerians to the worsening but purposefully crafted security situation in the state. All men of goodwill must intervene now and not allow desperate men forced reign of terror on the good people of Ogun State. But in his reaction, the publicity secretary of the category committee of Ogun APC, 
Tunde Oladu Joy absolved the APC from any form of political violence or removal of campaign advert materials. According to him, the party advert materials of the APC governorship candidate Prince Dakwa Abiodun were also removed, particularly in Abiogota Metropolis, urging ADC to be courageous to name the persons behind its holdings and not lumping APC with the culprits.